Hey guys, welcome back to Haven Bay. Today, I do hope that you enjoyed the small time lapse we did in the beginning. Uh, that's something I've been working on as as my throat has been getting better and I've been watching some series and stuff. I've been been watching Vikings lately and, and it's so much fun. And while I'm doing that, I just just been building a little bit here, been busy working out stuff and Haven Bay is really taking shape. Today we're going to be building another profession or another kind of store-ish thing in the bottom of the, the, this house here we did, which looks pretty cool, it's still very plain and what I like to do is to add the final details as the interiors in place so that you don't have windows in weird spots and stuff, but it all kind of aligns up with the interior nicely, so yeah, just like this where we have, uh, it's just like open and a little bit of plain right now but as the interior is done everything will look really really cool anyway we're gonna build the sick or like the first floor here, ground level of this build here which will be another profession and I'll try to show you guys uh, what kind of profession we are talking about here uh, of course the thumbnail already have spoiled that all for you guys but I want to see if I can if I can do it this cool way. We're gonna build this thing, a candle maker uh, that looks super weird. Uh, what if we um, we can use this one and then make that go out and then have this hanging on both sides like that? That's not too bad. I kind of like that. So uh, my friend. Trilaton, which is another Norwegian fellow Minecrafter doing both YouTube and also just a lot of building, uh, posted a picture of a cool candle maker, makery, whatever, and uh, I'm gonna take some inspiration from that. So thank you so much, Trilaton, for inspiration. So check him out on the YouTubes if uh, if you want to. I'm not gonna force anyone to do that, but he, he makes some really cool roleplay videos and. I think many of you guys would enjoy that. It's in the Conquest Reforge mod, so it should be up most of you guys alley. So yeah, I think you would enjoy. Anyway, let's just get building here. I want to do the ground here first. Um, there's some weird light glitches here, and I don't know what that's all about. But hey, I'm just gonna build right. So I'm gonna do like a mix of some sandstone and some gravel on the ground here and some of these sandstone bricks and smooth and the side and I think we're gonna come up with something really interesting something like that it fits the theme it's alright um, we have a lot of space back here if we need to so we're just gonna kind of see how much I don't want to dig out way too much here so we're gonna just see how much we need of that space but for now let's just get cracking shall we uh, what I want to have is uh, what, what Trilton did is that he had this kind of tub thing where he had like molten molten candles whatever it's called serene or whatever um, and you would just kind of have that like this so this is supposed to be like molten molten candles and then he would have um, these candles hanging down into that so we're gonna have some ropes and then how's an android looking for that that's not too bad but uh let's uh, get one of those um these ones looks pretty cool and there should be some other white ones we could use this one could work and also maybe some of these not super light ones did i not get that crap where did you go um there we go get that like that so now we can kind of have them hanging down like that into the water and we can have some empty ones like that can i can i change you the direction of you yes perfect uh, and then we can have a rail uh, like this going across so i have that going like that and then we can have some more candles hanging from this one into this so like that and then something like that 
and that's just lights or candles being made here and then what Trilton also did was to add this steam in here oh no uh, like that maybe maybe here yeah that's pretty cool because I know that it, it should be pretty hot in here I'm just gonna have some water my throat is still not 100% good so uh, I might be drinking some water today as well I'm prepared at least I'm gonna open my phone up here take another look at the picture alright there's nothing else than that what it did kind of but uh, I think that looks pretty dope. I, I think it's cool. Uh, what I would like to do though is in the back here, or maybe we could have. Okay, okay, I, I have an idea here. What if we have. Uh, no, crap, crap. Alright, there we go. So this one is heating up all of these things here, um, which is kind of cool and. Let me just have a bucket like that. So this is kind of keeping all this nice and hot so that it's melting. So you can dip these ropes and get serene lights or candles. I'm not sure if it's called serene or if it's just a Norwegian thing. <laughs> uh, anyway, get, let me know down below guys if that's completely off. Uh, and of course you're gonna have some barrels to store all of his uh, freshly made candles. We're gonna have that around here. Uh, possibly a small, I like these small chests, which is just a head model with a chest texture, which is pretty cool. Um, then we can have, we need a broom, but we also can have some blacksmith tools just hanging like that. Um, yeah, just gonna make like a super small uh, factory almost, where he creates this stuff. And he might even have like a desk here of some sort. Let's see if we can do that. Uh, we can use these ones and then just do it like this and go down and place them below like that. You in and yes, yeah, so that's a pretty cool design. We can put up some candles here which are undone, I think. Maybe some of these. No, come on now. Like that maybe, and more candles I suppose. Is it possible to get this one? Yeah, look at that. It's possible to get that one without the lights on. Um, so something like that maybe. And then yeah, with some, some buckets and stuff would always be good to have. Uh, and then maybe something like that with. Let's see what we have here to work with. Um, also pile of paper looking. Yeah, I just like that. It looks kind of. This is where he rolls the candles to make them round and stuff. Uh, just pretending a little bit here. Uh, very cool, cool stuff, cool stuff. Uh, maybe, maybe we should have a light that's or a candle that's lit up as well. Can I just place you. I cannot place you. Um. Weird, alright. Uh, I see why it's a redstone torch, but we'll do it like that then. And then we can have this torch here, maybe. Um, we can also have some storage right here. Uh, let's do it like this and then fill this one in. And then put in this one, that one, and some of these. In the ceiling like that and then we have some storage right there and it's kind of mood in here and I hope it's okay for you guys to see uh, I really do hope so maybe you should have a small counter to for visitors I suppose and then of course gonna have this gate door in the front here come on now is that not possible? Is there something blocking? No. Alright, so a small or actually a big gate uh, leading into this small room here, which is pretty nice. Let's uh, put up some stuff here. Some paintings. Um, put that right there. Maybe one of those with notes on would work. 
think that would be pretty cool. Come on now. I hate this painting thing. And there's no like GUI or something to to scroll through it. Come on now. Are you kidding with me? This is hopeful, hopeless. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm just gonna go for that one. Uh, and you can also see I added this small window in the back here for getting all of the smoke and steam out of this room to ventilate it a little bit. Uh, and overall, it looks pretty cool in here, I think. It's very simple, but it gets the job done. And that's the most important part, you know. Uh, I want to have a small carpet here as well like that uh, and then maybe it's a small one like that yeah very cool stuff uh, it's all nice and tied up in here and everything should be working let's add up a small uh, coat hanger here maybe just like that yeah where he kind of wears his uniform and I think that's about it guys it totally works and it's a nice cozy room uh, and it's a definitely a well needed needed profession in a town like this as candles very necessary to keep it light at dark times no to keep it light at dark times night times and stuff and in the desert I talked a little bit about this in my last episode uh, that um, it gets very quickly dark in the desert because of uh, the way the earth is tilted and stuff and you kind of want to have some lights and candles prepared for that so uh, I think candles would be really really necessary and a very very um, very needed uh, profession in a town like this so that's pretty cool to have that all down now so yeah and there's a small path leading up to this which is kind of cool and I like this small thing here uh, maybe Let's uh, let's see now. Do something. I'm just gonna test if I can do it like that, and then turn you around. Oh, maybe I can even. Oh, if I go this direction here. There we go, and then place them on like that. It will look a little bit better. Yeah, that's a lot better actually. That looks super cool. And then we can just kind of smooth out the sand here. I'm not going to smooth the sand out for all of these areas here, but I try to do it just be like next to the path, just because it makes it look a little bit better uh, and more realistic, I think. And then I'm just going to put in some some leaves and some stuff like that, because it looks kind of cool. Um, yeah, and yeah, let's keep this here and we can have some Some these leaves climbing up on the wall he walls here and stuff and Yeah guys that is all we got time for today. Uh, it's been a great episode. I think we did a lot of stuff We did this storage stuff right here. We did this crane and we also did that building right there And it turned out pretty cool. So thank you so much for watching guys I really do hope you enjoyed if so make sure to smack that like button and if you haven't done it already Make sure to subscribe. It's been Vigoman, and I'm out.